Nata Mandira. This structure has somehow survived to the current date. However, the roof of this structure no longer exists. This is where the temple dancers used to perform dances in homage to the sun god. The relief on the platform is similar in style to that found on the surviving walls of the temple. The Nata Mandira is exquisitely carved all across the base up to the top with the images of dancers, flora, hunters, musicians, human life cycle, gods and goddesses and many more. One can take a close look at the sculptures here along with the kids. However, for the principal monument, parental guidance is recommended. As you can see from here, the alignment of the sun temple is on the east-west direction. This Nata Mandira is on the eastern side facing the sea. It is guarded by two huge lions, each trying to kill an elephant and each elephant trampling on a man below. While the lions represent pride, elephants represent wealth. This depicts a message to the humankind that pride and wealth can lead to the downfall of a man. These sculptures are installed on two high stone benches on either side of the passage to the pillared platform of Nata Mandira. You can take the flight of steps to reach the platform of Nata Mandira above and take a quick view of the temple complex too. Please relax in the Nata Mandira while we share some facts about the Konaksan temple.